And now it is DTA's turn to do a comparison video of the Xbox One's amazing, amazing controller and the Xbox 360's amazing controller. And we also have a little sneak peek for you guys, the Xbox One, the Xbox 360, both amazing systems, not gonna lie. I'm just trying to get used to the Xbox One right now, you can see I'm installing Call of Duty Ghost. Gonna bring you guys some crazy gameplay of that uh, later on today. But uh, we're just messing around with it. I do love the controllers though, so that's what we're gonna get into real fast uh, is the Xbox 360's controller and the Xbox One's controller. Um, now, before I uh, say anything about them, overall I do think that the, three, uh, the Xbox 360's controller is pretty good. But uh, I'm gonna have to give this to uh, Xbox One here uh, before we even get into it. But um, I'm getting into it real fast here. Um, so the Xbox 360, everybody knows, is one of the best controllers of gaming. Um, I mean, it's so... I mean, look at this. I got wear marks all over this shit and everything. That's just for me using it so much. Um, it's such a, you know, sturdy controller. It's heavy. It's, you know, it's durable. It's so good. It's bulky and everything. Amazing, amazing controller. Um, you know, I like the button in the middle. I like the joysticks. They're nice and big and, um, you know, it's got that, the fabric on it or whatever you want to call it that, you know... It's good. It feels good on the on the thumb. You know, um, they, it moves good and stuff. The buttons on top are really easy. They go down nice and easy if you just you know even touch it, you know, and stuff like that. So I do love the uh, Xbox 360s controllers. Obviously, in the past years, nobody's really liked the uh, the bulk of the uh, the battery pack in the back of the controller. No one really liked that. So we go to the Xbox One's controller, which is currently on right now. And um, they changed a lot of stuff. Number one, the the button's not in the middle no more. Um, the the feel of the controller is a little bit different. It feels like kind of like a hard plastic, um, which feels really good. Which I don't even know what it's made out of, but it's just awesome. Um, what's cool is when you set it down, it like you can see how the 360s controller, you know, because the um, the Xbox One doesn't have the battery pack underneath it, but the 360 does, so it sits up nice. It looks very nice sitting up on the on a surface. Uh, very awesome. The the buttons in the back are a lot different. Um, the they're kind of like curved and more so you can kind of you know wrap your whole finger around it instead of having to use just the top of your finger. Um, the these buttons are a little bit kind of the same. The top buttons there, the uh, LB and RB, um, are about the same. But the the RT and LT are awesome. They're definitely uh, a lot better than the 360s um, uh, controller. The D-pad is definitely a lot different. It's actually built into the controller now instead of just bulking out like you see right there. Um, so it's cool. They don't have start and select anymore, but they do have these two new buttons. I don't know what they're called yet, so um, I'm, I apologize for that. But um, I, when I find it out, I'll let you guys know. Uh, once again, I do love the uh, the, the light-up uh, Xbox uh, logo on the top of the controller. Uh, moving on to the back here, the the battery pack slides out. I'm not gonna do it right right now, but it does slide out. You just gotta like you know pull it up and then you know take it out, whatever. So you don't have to like detach it, you know, like you do on the thing and then pull it out. But I do love the battery pack a lot more on the Xbox One's controller. Amazing, amazing, uh, a lot better than the uh, 360. But overall, I think that the Xbox One's controller does beat out the 360. I think people will definitely grow to love this controller. Um, I thought that this controller was going to be a lot like the Xbox, like the original Xbox's controller, but uh, why is this only on 0%? I'm going to have to do something about that. Um, but I thought this was going to be like the original Xbox controller, but I guess not. So uh, we'll have to... Uh, Wait and see how it plays out. So I'm gonna leave you guys there. I gotta fix, see what's happening with my ghost here. It's only on zero percent, and I've been installing it for the past five minutes, so it should be at least one percent. So we're gonna see what's gonna happen. But stay tuned to my channel for the next uh, day and a half here, and I'm gonna have plenty of gameplay and stuff for, of the Xbox One for you guys. So we'll get the two controllers there. But overall, once again, I do love the Xbox One because you know it's new and uh, just feels really good in the hand. So go pick you guys uh, selves up a copy of the Xbox One and. Come on and play with me. Peace.